And welcome back, you YouTube aholics. Uh, so we're going to finish this uh, part in really quick order. So I hope you weren't used to this character. What we've been playing as her for twenty minutes. I know. <laughs> it's way shorter than the other one. Oh. <laughs> no. You can't choose the second one. That's not the same guy. It is not. So we're going to quickly, I want to show you a, uh, by the way, do you like how they walk at the exact same time? <laughs> so yeah. that's what I am. That's Hypnotic. what I say too. <laughs> All right. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to show you a separate ending for this, for this file. Uh, and, uh, then we're going to do the one I actually want to, want to do. Um... Yeah, this surprised me that it was, like, because when you talk to that guy, if you go talk to him, they'll be like, there's a rescue helicopter here. And I was like, oh, it can't be over right now. And the thing is, it is. This is by far the shortest one. So... That's interesting. If your question is, what happens to the weird guy that, the weird teacher that follows you around? Don't know. Doesn't he, like, fall off or something? I guess. I guess it's just going to be just... Dies, but I that's remember that from last week. really weird. I think he does, but he comes back the first time, so I guess you just assume he dies. Unless you see him in like some other character's thing for some reason. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna do. Can you let her die? We're gonna do something at that time. <laughs> you. Is smart she enough. I like how the whole screen flashes when there's Stop lightning. Man, this theme song yeah, really reminds me of something it's specific, it's but I can't. She can't find it. <laughs> All right, we got a decision to make. Oh, help me! I'm guessing you're gonna choose the one where you kill her. That's my face. No, wait. She doesn't even say I'm sorry or anything. She's like not remorseful at all. And uh, now we're at the end. Like Dang. that's literally it. <laughs> so this was the first one that I felt was like underwhelming. I was very excited for it until it like suddenly finished, and I was like, oh, okay. Psychopath. Okay. And uh, that's it. You're now a killer. I think it would actually be quicker if I just reset the system, so I will. Once we see what she has to say, I think she just says something like, I let her fall. <laughs> <laughs> she becomes a, like a smoking ant immediately. Yeah. <laughs> Also, I've watched this a couple times now, and graphics on this, like right now, pretty dang impressive, in my opinion. I don't know why, I just I just thought that scene was very, uh, very cool looking. Okay. She would pour dirty toilet water all over me. When Emily asked me to help in the gym, without hesitation I helped her. But then I was mean. I left her and hurried on my way. I hated her. I made it to the rooftop by myself. The end. <laughs> so yeah, just wanted to show that off. Yeah, this is the the worst character by a lot. Yeah, not even close. Um, now I'm going to choose a different uh, saying that I said to the one-eyed guy. 
because it's just, uh, I guess we'll see in the future. It very slightly changes something later in the game. And I know that's what Raw Danger is all about, making a decision that slightly changes. You better call my handsome hunk. Oh, I just may. I actually thought I was the, the original pervert. I didn't. I didn't see his face. Yeah, out. and they they lead it that way. So you're like, you're the pervert. He's like, oh, is that what I am? Because he's British or something for some reason. Rest in peace, H Tech. Rest in peace, Irem. Do they still exist? I have no idea. I don't have my phone on me, so I can't look it up. Rest in peace, PS Two. Uh, all right. So, let us go ahead and. Start this again. And we will be done just that fast. So, and then we're going to start the... Technically the last character. I And I'll explain further as we as we continue on. Spencer is the raw danger king. I have... I, have be, I, I probably know more about this game than five people in the whole world. The, the, the two people who wrote facts know way more than me, but... I don't, I don't know about that. Hey, you're handsome. I'm handsome? Tell me something I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> me! <laughs> also, when you go talk to him... Oh, he actually sticks around. I can't believe I was so good looking. <laughs> me. <laughs> right. And that's it. So, we're gonna leave him. Even if you say, uh, I've tried all of them at this point. If you say, the helicopter series, like, there's something I need to finish. Judging by your saves, he's the last character. He is indeed the last character. Hopefully with, he's good. With an asterisk, because, uh, so once you beat the game once, and you go through it again, and you do very specific stuff, you unlock the actual last character, who... Is I'm not gonna say it. I know who it is. <laughs> I guess you know who it is already without me even getting there yet. But yes, it's a character near and dear to all one of you that have watched both <laughs> Disaster Report and Raw Danger. Play He's this. very special to us. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's all that matters. I don't even, you know, I love our fans and our 700 subs and whatever. But uh, I play these games for myself. Yeah, ultimately we just do LPs for ourselves. I mean, that's, that, all, that's, that's all that matters. That's how we've been doing it for so many years. And that's why we make Buku you, YouTube bucks on it. JK. Yeah, Spencer recently decided to monetize <laughs> to get all of one cent per video. <laughs> well, I mean, okay. Does oh, I think there's a thing that tells you how many videos or how many views you have overall. But, like, I mean, we have, like, what, 2,000 videos up? If even... Every video has uh, 20 views. That's probably $5. I'm so sorry about what I've done to you. Uh huh. Please forgive me. <laughs> I forgive you for all the evil things you've done to me. Thank you. I can't believe you saved me. I really am Are you sorry. saved yet? Thank you. I like how they decided to have that, like, conversation, like, as she's still hanging. It's just, like, you gotta, because there's nothing else to this scenario. Yeah. Apparently, you can also choose to, like, not have help her when she's in the gymnasium, and instead of, like, holding her like that, she'll just, like, limp behind you, which is, like, even more depressing. Yeah, so this, uh, this, uh... I feel like this is one of those where, like, they had bigger plans. Because, I mean, gosh, this has to be, like, 30 minutes long. Max. Yeah, remember the, the Scissor Man portion where it lasted 30 seconds? It was awesome for that 30 seconds, but, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to, uh, we're going to start with the last guy who has... Um, his his main meme of his story is something I guarantee that none of y'all out there have ever seen done before in anything. Y'all. But. 
I helped her up. I decided to forgive her. Dang. So yeah, once I finish this next, guys, um, I'll probably do the second run, obviously, uh, off-screen. And... Yeah, this LP is already... Yeah, it's super long. So. Yeah. Uh, and then I'll just start with the last character. I don't know if I'll finish today, because, truth be told, I haven't finished the other character yet in my other playthrough, but we have more time than I thought, so... We'll see. So, yeah, last character is Handsome Guy, with one eye, because reasons. I also think that he's the guy, when you played as Jod Howard, where, like, you could help him in the, uh, you could help him somewhere in, like, the the arcade or something like that, but then I forgot to. Mm. I think it's the same character. Yeah, I don't remember that at all. I kind of forget, too, but I think it's the same character. Question? A man who has amnesia. I guarantee, folks, I guarantee you've never watched a movie, played a game, or read a book about someone who had amnesia. Alright? So, this Wait is... Wait a minute. My name's Art Thompson. <laughs> the second reference? Huh? What the? Wow, you just start. I actually don't remember that. Oh, I think that's actually where you would have helped him. Um, like, he was literally in that spot. Also, this guy's uh, theme is a banger. <laughs> Holy crap, she is tiny? <laughs> or you're giant? Yeah, one of the two. Who am I? That's what I say, too. <laughs> and then she fades. What? <laughs> Man, her wetness meter was way too high. Yep. Blah. She's unconscious. I wonder who she is. I wonder who I is. Oh god, does he always walk like this? No. Okay. There's just significant slowdown right now. But there won't be the whole time. It's kind of slowed down, but I don't know. The All the water effects and the droplet effects and everything that's being rendered, it's so impressive that this is like running on the PS2. Mm hmm. Huh? Huh? What's up? What's that? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> My favorite character, Isaac Clark Schriller. Or Schiller. So, because this guy gets so many like things right away. How am I already in, like, five water droplets? Come on, man. I'm just gonna pick up everything. That's right. I'm not Vincent. <laughs> I'm not the most evil guy in the world. I'm some guy. It was just some guy. Uh, I came here at a request of my friend, Leon <laughs> S. I'm Kennedy. Sorry. You're not allowed here. If you need something, let's talk outside. Okay. What's up? Ugh. The worst sound design of all time. Yup. She looks exhausted. What do you think, Doc? Here, examine the patient. Ah, uh, stethoscope. You're short-handed right now. I appreciate your help, Doctor. She's all yours. Fragment of memory obtained. Job, doctor. <laughs> so yes, that's what you have to do. You have to put your memories uh, together. I know that amnesia is the the most trope thing in any narrative possible, but also I do kind of like amnesia as a plot device, as long as it's not like horribly generic. But it yeah. can be like a good way to like delve information for like a character. That is more important than you realize. I do like that. Yes, that is correct. I do like that. Sorry, I kind of forgot where I was going, but I think I just go next door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
So I believe this is where Isaac... Yeah, this is where Isaac started his uh, thing out, which is pretty cool. Huh? What's up? What's that? I like your your taco uh, um, compass thing. Thank you. It will probably be changing in five seconds. Where does this go? Where am I? What am I doing? Wow, they took everything in the store. All right. See ya, guy. Holy crap, you already have four droplets. No. Well, actually, the good news is I think I find something in here. So I need, oh, man. I need one food thing, even though I've gone the entire game and not done one food thing. Oh, for her? For, for later. Okay. I already have a garbage bag, so I think I'm good there. I do need the, I do need the duct tape, though. Oh, okay. I was and like, what is that? The reason I need it is we are going to assemble a makeshift coat. Oh. Because it's a garbage bag and it's adhesive tape. And I'm going to put that on. Oop. I'm going to put that on. <laughs> Your garbage bag duct tape thing. I guess it's better than nothing. Yeah. Well, it definitely looks like a garbage bag with tape on it. <laughs> Uh, absolutely based. Alright, what is this? Uh, that's food. Yeah, so I want to go here. Actually, I could definitely see that as, like, a zoomer, like, fashion accessory oh, sort of thing. Oh, yeah. So that's actually an item we, we absolutely need. And... Do I... Oh, whatever, I'll pick it up. I can always just toss it if the I The frame! Yeah, that was... Woo. Why is it chugging so hard here? It makes no sense. I think we need this too. Is there earmuffs? Oh. Oh yeah. I we don't need right. that, but we'll put them on. Can't even see them. Oh yeah, folks. You're gonna be so warm though. That's right. I was already here. Okay, so we're gonna head back to the laundromat because we only get four seconds until we're completely wet. You have your raincoat now. You're impervious to wetness. Just completely impervious. Okay. My body. It feels warm. Okay, so I also want to... I think I can assemble something else. I wonder why warm-up is even an option. You should just warm up automatically when you get next to, like, a, a barrel of fire. So I'm going to make a cardboard wall. Uh, and we are going to go... Where are we going? Yeah, over yeah, over here. So this guy, the dumbest guy in the history of the universe, is like, it's so cold. I wish I had more cardboard boxes to protect me from the cold wind. So we're gonna give him Dude, how long did this take you? Oh to figure so out? long! You don't even know. I'm doing I'm making this look so easy. This took forever. Yes, that's it. Let's assemble them. Yeah, you don't even know. It's still cold, but I feel much better. Take this. <laughs> yes! Yeah. I think I will. Obviously, I don't need to do that. Is it going to take off your coat? Yeah. Just probably keep your coat on. I I'm going to get something else in a little bit, so that's no problem. Wait. Uh, I don't want that. Was it... Did you need to do that at all? Nope. Oh, okay. Not in the least. But we are going to put these on. I just like helping these and Now you look like a doctor. <laughs> Myopian glasses. Sounds good. Oh, it's so much it's so much uh, warmer now, except for literally this. There's nothing there. Okay, so we are going to Oh yeah, I forgot the main thing I had to do. Which was treat my patient, mate. So I have to go to her and give her this like icy whatever thing. Because she has a fever. Uh, I see patch. She's stable, but still needs care. And this took me forever to figure out, too. You just have to use the stethoscope again. It's like her... And the stethoscope lets you know that her body what? is shivering. <laughs> <laughs> I need a blanket or something. That took me four... Yeah, I can't even begin to... Probably 20, 30 yeah, minutes. I mean, it's completely nonsensical. 
Oh yeah. Well, I gotta hear her heartbeat so I can know that she's shivering. She is definitely the he is definitely the worst doctor of all time. Also, I'm gonna just keep coming in here and being like, eh. red spots. Oh, it's lupus. It's the T virus. The eyes are hollow. That is some mistranslating. All right. So wait, where's my guy? I'm so. Dude, this guy is a giant. Why is he so much taller than everyone else? Okay, take this. A blanket. Thanks. Thanks for the wet, cold blanket. Thanks, buddy. All right. Uh, there's something else I'm looking for somewhere. Oh, you know what? I actually do. Oh yeah. I actually do need those uh, pans, dude. Get ready for this. This is the stupidest thing in the whole world, but I love it. I need to get four items, two of which are definitely these two pans. Because we are going to make... We're just going to MacGyver the heck out of this. The mother of all omelets, Jack. Yes, we are. That was a Metal Gear Rising uh, uh, reference. Assemble. Okay, so I need a broom and, like, a pole. Where do I get those? What are you making? Oars. A weapon to surpass Metal Gear. Yes, a weapon... A weapon to surpass Metal Gear. Uh, where do I go to get this? Where do I go to get this? It's definitely not in here. This place looks huge, but it really isn't. Alright. Uh, da -da -da -da. Definitely not in there. I don't want to help her yet. Definitely not there. There. And if I can't find it, there is another way around this. What is this? Another one? R9D compass. Yes. Yeah, you like that? Kind of reminds me of the Vic Viper from uh, Gradius. Oh, yeah. Okay. We're going to get past these frames real quick. All this frame rate it's given us. Walking. I don't know why I did that. Okay. I'm like... I'm like kind of blanking on where to get this. I need to go in... a building somewhere. There's not very many buildings I can get to. Yeah, no, you're absolutely right. It's down here. Not there. Uh, I would assume this was flooded, but it's not. No, it is. I don't think we can walk here. Thanks, guy. Is this something mandatory or is it optional? I do need an ore of some point, but... I'll figure it out. Maybe something I missed inside the... Because uh, I don't think it's in here. No. Definitely no items in here. I like how that one guy's not even doing anything. He's just like, can't be here. We're short-staffed. Yeah, I am... Hmm. Well, let me go wake her up. Maybe that'll help me remember. Oh, wait. What if... Yeah, I think this is actually it. Hey, guy, who I never used once. Okay, well, this isn't as fun, but these are the standard ores, since I couldn't find the oh, makeshift so ones. You, okay, so you make ores, sorry. Yeah, you can either make ores or you can use those ores, but I'm not going to spend a lot of time, but it's, it's funny. You can use two pans and two broom handles to make ores, but whatever. You, you know what it is, so... That's cool that there's like two different solutions yeah. to that. Yeah, again, I don't I don't know where the heck it's not back here, right? Yeah. I don't know. Whatever. It's somewhere. You can find those two items. She looks pale. I'm the best doctor in the world. Alright, so we're gonna use a blanket. And now she's not unconscious. 
Why don't you just move the table closer to the heater? Science. Huh? Oh. It's you. Please, come with me. David was... Honestly, I don't know you all, David. I think it has something to do with your head. It looks bad. You may have amnesia. Mm. Is that my name? Oh, no. How could you forget your own name? Your name is... You and David are good Kozla. friends, and he was my boyfriend. Uh, there's something I want to tell you. I heard David was killed by his sister. I can't believe that. David always talked about his sister. They were very close. I want to find out what really happened to David. Okay. And I'm scared. I can't do it alone. Fragment of memory obtained. So you can use these fragments of memory to make uh, memories. Please come with me to check out David's apartment. Okay, I'll go with you. Really? Thank you so much. This is a very specific in an apartment um, complex called Landmark Apartments. It's not far from here. This is a very specific comparison, but uh, the Miles Edgeworth Investigations game on DS has a very similar mechanic where you uh. combine two clues together to make a new deduction uh, while you're investigating a crime scene. It, like That really reminds me of like connecting two memories together type of thing. So, uh, then we deduce that my name is... Ah. Wow, and this game... Yeah, this game definitely came out before Miles Edgeworth, so it, like, it almost seems like that game copied this. It's like exactly the same. I was called Doctor. Oh, sorry. I wear a white gown. Ching! My job is... I remember my job. I think I was a doctor. And I don't think we have any personality stuff yet. Nope. This is pretty cool, actually. I know, right? That's, again, another thing where this game just constantly throws these ideas out. And they're just like, anything that sticks, that's what we're doing. Time to turn the TV down 30%. Love this game. Ooh. Job, air mattress. What? What? What's with the air mattress? I need this to help treat the injury. I understand. You're quite a doctor. Sure. <laughs> Let me help you carry this. Who needs help carrying an air mattress? What? <laughs> Also, look at their arms. <laughs> Do you see their arms? Especially since the one guy is shorter than you. His oh, arms, yeah, his arms are super. They're like gorilla arms. <laughs> <laughs> this game's a 10 out of 10. I know, right? Hey, girl. You like this air matches? I'm trying to go in between her. Oh, my God. I'm not even trying to go backwards. This is the same controls. Remember when I said that moving those, uh, moving the, uh, ladders is weird? This is the exact same controls. There, we did it! We did it! <laughs> Literally wacky waving inflatable arm tube man, us. I'm not a medical expert. <laughs> the worst whatever that guy is ever. Huh? How's this gonna help the? How's this gonna help the injured? Uh, well, I'm not a medical expert. I also feel as if an air mattress on raging waters would be the absolute worst choice they can do. It has no weight at all. Well, I mean, it's gonna get carried away. I, I don't even know if the second you put your weight on it, that you wouldn't just instantly sink. Yeah, know? that's true as well. It would have to be inflated like a lot. Well, 